here is a refresher on what the quest is. Uh, Birdie on Ginger Island gave us a picture, and she wants in return a keepsake of her husband, so this is what she gave us. The War Memento. And uh, I've been doing some thinking before recording this. Um, my first thought was to give this to the guy at the museum, since he's big into, like, history and stuff. But, uh, you can't, like, access him at all. <laughs> he's behind the counter and he doesn't live anywhere, like, so it's not him. So, it's a photograph of a soldier. And Kent is a soldier, so we're gonna try him. Alright, uh, we're not doing anything with the farm today. We're not doing anything else, as far as I'm aware, except completing this quest. So, well, besides loving on my children, of course, uh, let's go find them. <laughs> Got a big fish tank there. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, whoa. All right, we're not doing anything on the farm. I gotta remind myself. We're not. There's so many things. Oh, man. Alright. And we do have some coffee in case I need to speed up for any reason. Alright. It is a beautiful, rainy day here in Stardew Valley. Uh, what time does Kent get up and stand out here? Not yet, apparently. Okay. here. Let's put this away. Kent, please. Please, I need help. I need help. Oh, I wonder if it's because it's raining he won't come out. Uh, oh, hey. She's out and about early. Let's get these berries and then go back for him, because his house will open at, uh, nine. Alright. Oh yeah, maybe we should move the coffee too, because I don't want to accidentally give these people, I assume, what we're going to be doing is trading up. Um, and I've mentioned this before, uh, there's something like it in Spyro, which is one of my favorite games. Uh, Spyro 3, 2, 3, 2. And there he is. It's the man himself. Okay, here we go. Hey, does this look familiar to you? Oh man, look at his face. Yikes. Where did you find this? This man, we fought together in the war, Chooser. He was like a brother to me. Oh my goodness. I'm glad it's being returned to you. But only one of us made it back. Yikes. He never lost his courage, though. Even in the face of death. A true hero. I'll never forget him. Thanks for bringing me this. It means a lot to me. Here, take this. It's been sitting in the back of our cupboard for years, and we've never used it. Received a gourmet tomato salt. Yep. Okay. That is exactly what I was expecting. Alright, here we go. So, basically, we're just going to be going to visit different people all day with different items. So, this is clearly for this guy. But that 
doesn't open until 12. That's not good. Can he be found anywhere else? Okay, not in here. Sometimes I have seen him in there. Let's try the community center and see if he's in there instead. Yo, Gus. Are you in here? Dang, he's not. Okay, well, we have until 12, so we can do a couple things on the farm. <laughs> See. Grab some more berries, just some supplemental income for today. Alright, don't forget, we have to be back at the saloon at 12 noon. Alright, we can uh, sell a couple things. In the meantime, come along, horsey. As you can see, I've been trying to decorate my farm a little bit and make it look a little bit nicer. Uh, 15. I need 15 ancient fruit. Here we go. Yeah, I put a bed and things like that. Oh, and check these out. I have the island and the desert. Um, whoops. Warp totems. The big ones on my farm. So that's super exciting. Fantastic. Okay, cool. Perfect timing. Let's go back to the saloon and continue on with this quest. We are giving the tomato salt to Gus because he is like the cook of Stardew Valley. So let's get in there and then see what's next. Here we go. Hey Sebastian, what's up? Gus, my man, just who I'm looking for. Let me talk to you first. Hi, please relax and enjoy yourself. Oh, okay. Sniff, sniff. That sharp smell. Slurp, slurp. That zesty taste. That gritty texture. It can only be gourmet tomato salt. I'll trade you for it. You received a Stardew Valley rose. Okay. A rose that reminds you of the valley. It smells heavenly reminds you of the valley. Okay. Okay. So, Evelyn, the old lady, is a gardener, and she tends the garden here in town. So she would be my first thought. But why would she need to be reminded of the valley? Hold on. Reminded. Okay, here's Evelyn. Reminded of the valley. Is there anyone who's not here? Oh. Okay, alright. Let's try the obvious assumption first, which is Evelyn. And then if she doesn't want it, I think let's go out on a limb and say Sandy, because why would Evelyn need to be reminded of the valley? She grew up here. All right, here we go. Let's give it a shot. Evelyn. Oh my goodness, what? <laughs> what is happening? This man is freaking out. Chooser, what's the meaning of all of this? Is this some kind of prank? Uh, oh, oh, I finished his leak quest. He needed 12 leaks. And I finished that, and that's where I got the coffee machine. <laughs> yes, it's a prank. <laughs> that's mean. We wanted to show our appreciation. That's nice to say. 
leak. Look, he's holding it. Oh, leak. Oh, it's so cute. Get this man a leak plushie stat. My favorite. Just like Mama used to make so many years ago. Well. Da -da -da. Well, that... <laughs> Guess maybe I'm not as forgotten and ignored as I thought. No, sir. Thanks, hon. Oh, you're so welcome. You made an old man's day. That's very nice. Hey, yo, Evelyn. Hey, yo. What up? When I woke up, I heard dripping from somewhere. I thought the roof might be leaking. <laughs> right? That's a very pretty rose, dear. Have you shown it to Emily? It makes me think of her. Uh, no. I hadn't, I hadn't thought about Emily. Oh, crap. Do we need to make a detour to Emily? Why would Emily need what? Emily, she's not here. All right, we're not doing that. I think we need to try Sandy. Oh, you know what? Emily and Sandy are friends. She's probably like trying to lead us in the right direction. Okay, here we go. We are going to take the, um, oh, do I have a warp home totem? Let me see. Oh, no, 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 it's fine. Uh, here we go. Yes, drink the coffee. We're gonna leave the horse at the bus station. Doink. All right, and now we're going to sprint to the desert. All right, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. We are sprinting. Desert. Whoa, so many coconuts and things. So many, I've never seen so many coconuts here. All right, put those away. I don't want to get distracted. Here we go, Sandy. You poor bird thing. Yeah, you're telling me. Uh, there, ooh, yummy too. Madam, please take this rose. A Stardew Valley rose. That's so lovely, thank you. Whenever I miss the valley, see, there it is. Whenever I miss the valley, I'll smell this rose. He Here, take this. It's been on the shelf for 10 years and no one has bought it. You can have it. You received an advanced TV remote. Well, we were just there. We were just at the old man's house. George, I think his name is. Let's go give the remote to him because he is a big TV aficionado. All right. My horse should be waiting right here for me. Your loyal horse waits patiently for your return. How sweet. Sir Horsington is waiting for me. All right, George, we're back. We're back. There he is. He's sitting in front of the TV right now. It's awful cold, isn't it? What a rotten day. Oh, it's springtime. What's this? So you push this button first. What's this button do? Crumble, crumble. Well, how about that? It's a new channel. Oh. Here, take this. It's a stone I found when I was a coal miner back in the day. Funny thing, it's glowed blue and stayed cold for over 40 years. Like magic. You received an arctic shard. Okay, for sure we know who anything magic goes to. And that would be the wizard. So let's run over to the wizard's house, his tower, and we'll 
see how many more steps there are going to be in this one. I'm very curious. Ooh, berries. I shouldn't be doing this. Sorry, don't stop for berries. We just need to keep going. Because I don't know how long this is going to take. I don't know if it can be done in a single day, and I really hope that it can. Alright. Oh, the berries are so tempting. Yo, wizard. Wizard, help me out. Stormy days are the only time I can commune with certain elementals. I don't expect you to understand. Okay. Ah, an arctic shard. A most powerful substance indeed. And potently infused with the element of ice. I'll take it if you don't mind. Not at all. But I need something back. Erm, you're still here. Oh, you want something? Take this. <laughs> you received a wriggling worm. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Alright, well, we also know who this one goes to. That's good that they're all pretty obvious, with the exception of the rose. I think that one was the only one that I got a little confused on. And we'll see what um, Willie gives us. The worm absolutely goes to him because he is a fisherman. So let's go pay him a visit. He should be in his shop right until 5 p.m. Yeah, so we might catch him leaving his shop. Alright. Let's do this. Let's put this away. Oh my gosh, so many things. There he is. Hey. Ah, oh, that's the perfect bait for a catfish I've been trying to catch. Here, let me trade you this for it. I'm not sure what it is, but it washed up on the beach not too long ago. Something tells me you could use it, miss. Oh. Oh. You received a pirate's locket. Oh my gosh. This is the thing that she wants. Okay, great. So... That wasn't, that wasn't too bad at all. Great. So let's pick this stuff up. I have so many things in my inventory right now. <laughs> Just stockpiling them. Alright, and now let's take our beautiful new island warp totem and go give this to Birdie, because this is what she wants. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Nice, we made good time today. Very good. Alright. Let's just enjoy the rain sounds, because I assume it is not going to be raining on uh, Ginger Island. They kind of have, like, different weather cycles. Okay. still has his smell after all these years. That familiar putrid funk. <laughs> you know, 
It's been a lonely life here, child, but I don't regret it at all. I'm doing right by my old man, and we'll be together again someday soon. <laughs> it's an honorable thing to do. You have great wisdom, child, and you've brought me great peace. This locket will comfort me for the rest of my days. Now, how can I repay you for this? Oh, how about I teach you a special recipe? Something I discovered in the many years I've spent here. Learned to craft fairy dust. Interesting. You can take these too. Oh, thank you. Though you're a stranger, you went out of your way to help an old lady. Bless your heart. Aww. That is really cute. That is really, really cute. Alright, I'm glad. I'm very glad that we were able to do that for her and bring her peace. That's wonderful. And now we get to harvest these nine billion pineapples. All right, are you ready? I'm so ready. <laughs> this is gonna be a lot of money. Oh yeah, my gourmand statue, I forgot. That in the meantime, I uh, finished all the gourmand quests. That was really fun. He's a pretty funny little dude. Ah, uh, do I have some more pineapple seeds? Hopefully. Might as well just spend the night here. Let's go ahead and sleep. 
have not decorated this house at all. source of income to have just all of those pineapples on Ginger Island. That's huge. All right, well, that was fantastic. Well, guys, as always, thank you so, so much for watching, and I will catch you next time.